I muted Kathy, right? Because in the beginning, excellent. Well, I'm excited. I'm excited to welcome you to my very first Lip Teeny party. And um, let's see, on the inside, I'm excited to see right before I throw it uh, and get the party started. I just want to hear from guests that are on. If you're a guest watching on YouTube or you're a guest watching in here, can you type in the chat? Would you type in the chat if you're a guest so I know who my bona fide certified guests are? Lakeisha Ashford. And who are you a guest of, Lakeisha? Lakeisha, Lakeisha, Lakeisha. I'm looking to see. Lakeisha, who are you a guest of? Rose Watt. Hey, Rose has a guest. Awesome. And who are the other guests? Who are the other guests? Excellent. Lakeisha Ashford is a guest of Duena. Excellent. Excellent. And so, Duena, I'm going to throw you um, the co-host in here, and um, I am throwing you this co-host so that if during the time you need to let me know what's happening in the chat, a question that somebody's asking or whatever, um, we're going to go ahead and get the party started. So this is cool. My name is Katrina Harris Earl, and I've been building my business for 30 years. So I know what I'm doing, but this virtual world is new and bringing you this lip teeny party is new as well. And so, um, you know, God ministers to me about all things. And he even gave me the juice on um, making this party fun and keeping it super, super exciting. And so I want to um, share with y'all um some of what we are going to do today we are going to have some fun if you don't have a um i'm trying to bring something up on my phone and i got a new phone and i don't know the password to this app so hold on i got to pull up my evernote on the computer here praise god for multiple screens so tonight we are going to or this afternoon we're going to have some uh, real fun with our lip teeny party and i am going to just print this out right quick here so I have it with me. It would have been great. We had a little um, family situation today and it delayed me a little bit. Y'all know how, how that is real life. And I have another real lifer, which is, forgive me, uh, which is called a charger, which means when you have your phone, your husband borrows your charger and it's not here. <laughs> so hold on one second. I need my charger. My computer's about to die. Would you mind bringing it, babe? Thanks. Okay, I'm live on YouTube. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, my husband, like my daddy, he always gonna give you pushback. All right, so welcome, welcome, welcome. If you have a piece of paper, Grab, um, grab it. If you don't have a piece of paper, if you can grab it, and I want you to write out a tic-tac-toe. Write out a tic-tac-toe because this is going to be an opportunity for you to write what you love. And so I want you to share um, some of the things that you love, that you fall in love with today. We want to um, hear from you and be able to see. I'm going to share quite a few things. And so I want to know which products you absolutely positively fall in love with and um so grab that uh tic-tac-toe and as i'm going through all of the different goodies you can write it out um when i do these lip teeny parties in the future a really fun thing that i'm going to do is have people grab the most come to the party with the most beautiful um the most beautiful um oh it's over here plugged in on a different side. Thank you. With the most beautiful glass they have. So if there's a guest that's on and you have a beautiful glass, I just ordered myself a um, sorority martini glass so I can have it for my lip teeny party. So that's going to be a lot of fun. Whether you're drinking water like me, you can still have it in a martini glass. Is there anybody who really, really, really is? So we're going to do that. And then it's okay. It can. Okay. And um, then I want you to um, write down who you know. Think of a, on one side of the tic-tac-toe, you are going to write down the products you 
love. So you're going to have a tic-tac-toe to write down all the products you love and then have another tic-tac-toe on the other side, thanks, to write down any people that you feel would love this Liptini experience, okay? So let's start off with a really fun game. Everyone needs to type in the chat. I'm pulling up the YouTube chat also. What is your lipstick name? So your lipstick name is the color of your shirt and your pet's name, okay? <laughs> so your pet's name. If you don't have a pet, think of the pet you used to have, your friend's pet, your uh, boyfriend's pet, somebody's name, okay? I want to come up with it. So I have, um, I'll tell you what my lipstick name is, <laughs> Black Fletcher. <laughs> Black Fletcher, or I could be Black Max, or I could be Black Princess. I think I like Black Princess. So my lipstick name is Black Princess. Uh, gray Whiskey, Ruby is Gray Whiskey. We got Black Daisy. We got <laughs> Blue Lucy, <laughs> Black Balls. <laughs> no lipstick name, I'm sorry, Alicia. I'm sorry, Blue Yoda, that would probably sell. So that's your lipstick name, <laughs> okay? So that's a lot of fun. And just run away. Okay, you have four pets. Okay, exactly. I went down the line and Max is at my feet. So I really should be Black Max, but I like Black Princess better. Blue Baxter. <laughs> I love that. Let's see, YouTube says Blue Doug, Multicolor Buffy, Blue Snowball. <laughs> okay. So if I were doing it and there were 50 people on here, we definitely would be unmuted and having, having a ball with this with our martinis. Now, here's another name. So you, you could decide which one you like better because I'm extra. So I wanted to give you two possibilities. So here's another one, the first letter of your first name and the month you were born. So I am Katrina with a C, born in January. So I'm Couture Appleberry. So what is yours? Um, oh, wow. Maria says, nude maroon rose buddy. <laughs> How you gonna fit all that on the lipstick? <laughs> so um, let me see. What else do we have? Darling Raspberry. Now, Duena, that one's nice. So decide which one you like. I think I'm gonna stick with Black Princess. So that's gonna be my lip color. My lipstick name is Black Princess, Black Princess. But I'm giving you a second to decide which one of these um, is your lipstick name. Let me hear from a couple, couple others of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Anybody else? Hot Sunset Peach. Hey, Helen. Royalty Raspberry Ice. Luscious Raspberry. Mysterious Red Smolder. Now, these names, this might be even the better game, okay? <laughs> I really like this one. Okay, so that's cool. And um, the cool thing is, the next thing is, we're going to say, what does your lipstick person, lipstick say about you? What does your lipstick say about you? So what is your lipstick color that you have on now or that you had on yesterday or the last time you had on lipstick? What does it say about you? Was it red, pink? My lip color is lion today because I don't know if I, my husband would be like, patient, patient, kind, energetic, sophisticated, or warm. I'm gonna, I'm saying mine is probably leaning more toward warm, okay? So, oh, I love it. Thrilling Raspberry Ice is Tammy Denson. Thrilling Rosette, Sophisticated Spice is Ginger. Yummy Sunset Peach, Velvet Rosewood. I mean, we got some jamming names here. Okay, Mia's is kind, Helen is warm. I love it, Lakeisha is energetic. So these are just really fun. And then to get a little bit more serious, Pucker up. This is Mary Kay, actually. Pucker up. When? What do your results say about your kiss? Okay. So if you have lipstick on, what you do is you grab a piece of paper, your tic-tac-toe, and you kiss it. And you find the one that looks most like it. I got to I'm going to um, take this light and have it for when I need the color because I think it's, it's so bright. So here we go. This one right here. So what does yours look like? You got to look and put it up. Hmm. I don't know which one I am. I got a big old bottom lip going on. I think I'm Miss Spotlight. 
Are you a singer? No, in the shower, a movie star in the shower. You might as well be. You have the charisma of a natural born stunner and you have the attitude to match. So flirt, imagine and enjoy the attention. That's me. So you can screenshot this and do this later. And let's see, Vicki, did you kiss? What's yours? I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. I want to give you guys the ability to, to unmute um, as long as we got the mutes control. Uh, I love it. Brenda Boykins is soulful. I know there's a little bit. Uh, we're still going down here. There's always a little bit of delay. Sensitive soul is Valentina. Passion princess is Jamie. Oh, okay. So passion princess. So Valentina is a sensitive soul. That really describes you. Ever the idealist. You approach life with a big heart and an even big. Sometimes I think this thing got truth to it. An even bigger yearning for romance. You're sensitive, sweet, Valentina, and feel life very deeply. And those around you appreciate you exactly as you are. Um, that is so, so good. Um, Jamie McDonald, I don't know you, but Passion Princess, does this describe you? You're private yet passionate. You have secrets, but you like to share with the right person. You love having control and not easily fooled and enjoy those who share similar traits. Passion, anyone? Okay. Cheryl Harvey, free spirit. Hello, girl. You're a true individual. <laughs> always the optimist this is so you Cheryl and you make up the rules as you go that's why your friends and you have plenty of them love you maybe it's time to throw a little party okay Georgia says she's a born leader Vicky a rebel <laughs> rebel <laughs> I love it Sonia a natural lover an inspiring optimist oh my gosh Dwayna okay life is full of possibilities it's evident in your smile it's bright big, bright, and makes everyone around you feel better. Doesn't it feel good to be inspired and inspiring? There's nothing you can't do. So we have somebody, did anybody get the lucky one? Or did anybody get mystery maker? So that's cool. Okay, so let's get the party started. That was the party already. What type of lips do you have? So it's important to know your lip shape because um, sometimes we used to take full lips and want to line them so you can make them thinner and take thin lips and line them so you can make them fuller, but you can just own your lip shape, but it's just good to know what you're working with because it, it's, you know, the fuller your lips, a bright is going to look different. Um, and so just know your lip shape, full lips, heavy upper lip, wide lips, round lips, heavy lower lip. That's me. This one, it drags the ground. I got, a, I got a lot of lower lip going on. Thin lips, bow-shaped lips, heart-shaped lips, downward turn lips. So what is your lip shape? I inherited my lip shape from my mama, the heavy lower lip. There we go, okay? So the very first thing that you want to do with your lips is I am going to take my lipstick my lips off with my oil-free eye makeup remover that I swear was here a moment ago, but my mom can grab it for me. Um, I had it, I really did. So, but I have my Meissler water. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove, I tell you, I set up for this, I let everything out and then it looked like it walked away. So I'm removing my lipstick. And the very first thing you need is satin lips. Okay, satin lips is essential. Consultants type in the chat what you love most about satin lips and any of the guests already using satin lips. You cannot do lipstick well with dead dry skin. So you take this, it's a two-step process. It is lip scrub and a balm. Yes, absolutely. And even though I sell this stuff, I had to remind myself, girl, your lips is dry. You need this. You kind of massage it like this and it's gentle because of the shea butter, but it's gonna get rid of all that dead skin. Now, depending on your lip shape, it's gonna depend how much work you gotta do because I got that lower bottom lip happening. I gotta stick it out and do this right here. That's like that, okay? And so then you can just set it up there. Thanks, mom. And so, and a damp, I had my damp towel, but that would be great. It's good to have a damp towel. Our brand new Meissler water is 
amazing. This is a pre-wash for your face before your cleanser, and it's really good just to wash. Okay, I love it. Laura, raise your hand if you have, uh, if that might have been an accident, so you can type in the chat. Yeah, removes dead skin. Yes, Rose says she loves it. It removes dead skin. And so you wanna be sure that you get it all off. Normally, I have a nice damp towel that's there, okay? And so there you go. And then you apply the lip balm. Now I like to do my lip balm at night. I normally don't necessarily do my lip balm in the daytime. I do the lip primer or my pH uh, lip balm that we have. But if I put it on the daytime, I put a real little bit amount on if I'm about to apply my lipstick, okay? So that is satin lips. This is the lip primer. The lip primer, primer is everything. We have foundation primer, we have eye primer. The lip primer helps to prime your lips. So you want to get this and you literally just apply it right before you apply your lipstick. And you're gonna fall in love with the way, just a paper, um, uh, a washcloth, because I'm gonna be using lots of them. I had two of them, There's, it's sitting right around here, but just damp washcloths if you would. So this is the um, lip primer, which is amazing. And so you just apply it right on and you see how it kind of helps. I, I don't put foundation on my lips, but I do take the residue from my sponge and I go over my lips because my lips are very pink. It's very important for women to know, um, especially uh, black women tend to have a lot of um, of pink going on on their lips that's a high contrast from their uh, skin tone and it will change the color of your lips. So now let's get juicy with it and let's talk about our glosses. Our glosses are amazing in everything and our glosses, we just won the beauty award, all right? Beauty Award, the Mary Kay Ultimate Lip Gloss, best lip gloss ever from Better Homes and Garden. And so this is amazing. This is totally amazing. Um, you will just totally love this, all right? Um, we believe that lipstick can change the world. And I'm going to tell you at the very end what is happening with lipsticks right now. The masks have come off and the lipsticks are going through the roof. So we're going to go through our lip glosses in three different shades, uh, three different categories, the creams, the pearls, and the shimmers. We're going to talk about each of those. I have my girlfriend, um, Leah Carta, and she um, put on uh, all of the colors on her arm, and I put all the colors on my arm, and you can see them side by side. So ivory um, and bronze. And of course, um, my beige sisters would be right in the middle there. So you're going to see from evening berry to iconic red to berry delight to pink fusion to fancy Nancy to pink ballerina, unique mauve, nude blush, copper aura, um, beach bronze, chocolate nude, tawny nude. I'm pulling my arm up because I'm going to need a lot of arm. Um, sheer illusion and soft nude. There's nothing like a great pink lip. There's nothing like a great red lip and there's nothing like a nude lip. We love them all. So um, take a look. One of the nice things about our glosses is you get a lot of gloss, high shine. It's super high shine. And these are must haves, must haves. You can't have enough. This is new glosses. a video. Look how pretty the shades look. Can you see those shades? Pop and pop and pop and pop and pop. That's my arm. Pop and <laughs> So let's talk about them and show you. Consultants can get this to your client and it will show you all of the colors and what they look like with on um, ivory, beige, and bronze. And this is my favorite makeup artist on the planet, Juliana Mayfield. Uh, and she is sporting all of these amazing lipsticks. So for the guests that are on, this might be a good page to screenshot because just to look and remember which color are you going for. So when I came on, I had on the nude um, blush color going on 
yesterday I was working the tawny nude. So let's um, do a couple different shades here and I'm gonna start striping away. So let's do, um, well, let me just show this before we talk about, talk color. Mary Kay versus Mac and Sephora. So look down here at the glosses, okay? Um, when you look, our glosses, uh, oops, I got my name going all over there. You could easily, our glosses are 16. And so you can look and easily see what you are um, paying and the difference. How many of you have bought brand X and you know that you could spend $30 on a gloss, right? Um, ours is 16 and when you're a beauty consultant, it's eight. So it's a great reason <laughs> to consider becoming a consultant. Um, let me just tell you this, because uh, before I stop sharing the screen, um, I didn't necessarily agree with this one, what your lipstick says about you, okay? What it says about your love life, what it says about your career. I had on pale pink. So it says I had a great love life, not a good career. And <laughs> I don't agree with that one. So I don't know about you. But let's start striping and checking out these glosses. So we're going to go back here to the sheer family. Let's see. We're going to start with the creams. So starting with the creams, um, we're going to start at the top here with Iconic Red. And this will be really cool consultants to partner with a beauty consultant and do these both at the same time. This iconic red is so rich. Now I'm going to mix in and tell you at the same time, if you add in liners, your liner and your lipstick can make your lip gloss last so much longer. So I'm showing you the glosses. I'm gonna go through all the glosses, but if you really want your lip color to have that powerful punch and last a long time, you wanna think about adding in the liners. As a matter of fact, I think I'm gonna show you liners first. So let me just do this here. And I'm going to do the liners first. You hear the noise, that would be my mama. Okay. Hey, Yolanda. So this is Light Nude. I love this Light Nude when I wear, it's more like a lighter pink on my color. And if we do it here, it's more nude. So this shows you kind of on the beige family. Everybody needs this. Almost every skin tone needs this because don't be afraid of a lighter color, okay? This is, next time I'll set it up where you can be here too. This is medium nude. So this one is the medium nude. And here it is here. So you can kind of see that medium nude. This might be where I need that. It's hard to get the perfect natural color. Natural lighting. I'm trying to get enough lighting where you can see. Okay. This one is must have okay i mean seriously you need it's this the what's in fashion now is almost even if you're wearing red you could wear a nude lip liner you don't have to do red lip liner with red lips and pink lip liner with pink every woman needs a nude and you almost need all of these nudes can you see the difference in how those nudes are so this is the dark nude or the deep nude which is what i wear and you can still see here Everybody can work this. And don't be afraid, even for ivory, to go that dark. Make up your friend as long as you blend. You don't want to see it on. But my lips are looking really great because of the satin lips and that lip primer. I'm telling you. Like some days I just run in fast and don't do lip primer. And I'm reminded how important it is. This one is rose. So when you rock it, it's going to make a difference. All right. Then we have coral. So I'm going to offer you something really special at the end because sometimes we get in a lipstick rut and you want to know the fastest way, two things a woman can do to shape up, shake up your makeup or shake up your look, change your hair, change your lipstick. 
this is the two fastest things. Baby, I love eye color. I love lashes, but you could throw on some shades, my shades over there, and a good lipstick, and you could have nothing else on, not even your foundation. So this one is coral. You can see it's on the end there is the coral. This is red. So I just had the red. It's really pigmented, y'all. These are really, really pigmented colors. Really pigmented colors. Don't sleep on liner. Um, dark chocolate. Now, let me just say something with the dark chocolate. A lot of people use this in their brows, not the same one, but a different one. Some people even use the nudes, depending on what you got going on. This is the dark chocolate. My most common one I'm wearing now is the deep nude. And then this one is berry. So let me just say this. I'm on the Black Women's Advisory Committee. There are a lot of other great lines out there. But when I tell you, first of all, we got colors for you. I'm telling you. What does that mean when she says, don't sleep on the liners? What I mean by that is most women don't use a liner. Most women don't use a liner. They just um, they just put go, they go to town on their lips. They don't just necessarily use a liner. The dark chocolate liner is your favorite with any lip color. Yeah, so depending on your shade. So can you see the difference of what's gonna happen with the liners when you apply them? Okay, so now let's go back to Iconic Red. So I could rock my iconic red with that red liner. Isn't that amazing? So this is cream, okay? And can we just talk about the fact that this amazing brush holder works great for brushes and great for your glosses, keeps them nice and neat. The next one we're gonna do is, I think it's Pink Fusion. I feel like there was one other. Okay, so here's Pink Fusion. And you can rock this one. How rich it is. You see it? Okay. Um, now we're going to go to Unique Mauve. Unique Mauve. Probably needed to have a lookbook here and make sure that all of them that are in the cream family everything in the cream family pink fusion unique mauve i am going in the right order here here's unique mauve this one i love it no yeah this is this one is not unique mauve that is pink ballerina unique mauve is this one this is unique mauve it's a good muted color now these gloss, when I first got the tip on these, I thought something's wrong, it's wobbly. It's made like that. That's what gets it on there. As a matter of fact, this is the mood I'm in today, this unique mauve with that liner. It's so rich, you guys. It's so super rich, unique mauve. Nude blush. I'm trying to tell y'all, every woman needs to have four or five of these. So this is nude blush. So don't think just because you're ivory, you got to go with the with the unique, you know, with the lighter ones and vice versa. That's really, really great. Um, you can blend it. And I'm telling you, I, I, there's not any of these colors that I can't wear, but if you got to pick one of them for me, if I had to take one and run, if I I would have to take two and run, it would be Tawny Nude my new camera, Tawny Nude and Iconic Red are the two that I couldn't live without. So here we go, Tawny Nude. I put Tawny Nude with that Deep Nude for the, love it, okay? So this is amazing. I'm gonna go through. Um, so that was, let's see, and then Chocolate Nude is under the creams also. So then we go Chocolate Nude. It's very chocolate and you could put that on. I put it on right there on the other side of the tawny. Sometimes I mix them. 
and I don't necessarily mix them together. I'll put the lighter one on the inner side, inside and the other one here and kind of pat like that. So you can totally mix them, but so that one is the chocolate. Amazing, okay? Yes, there's so many great colors. Now we're gonna go to the pearl ones. Pearl, 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 pearl. So this is what I'm working with here. I'm gonna go ahead and show you the power of now just to show you i use just a little bit of water i use some water but because i'm moving fast with y'all and i'm um running out of time i really applied a lot of pressure you don't want to apply a lot of pressure but i mean i applied a lot of pressure and you see some of them liners are still there you got to really 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 rub that thing out and that is where our oil-free eye makeup remover comes in handy because it doesn't just remove. Look, when I do this with water, it ain't taking that off. You see, it ain't going nowhere. This has this is totally damp, and it's not going anywhere. I had to really like get down with to get down, <laughs> and it's still. I mean, these things last, baby. They last. So, our oil-free eye makeup remover is I use it to remove my eye makeup, but I also use it to remove my lipstick and lip gloss with a cotton pad normally and totally clean. Must have, if you want, you know how you had on red and now you wanna to go to nude and you sometimes you feel like you gotta to totally start over or put foundation over your lips to just get rid of that stain, gone. All right, so let's do this and let's keep it moving pretty quickly. So Pearl, we're gonna go to Pearl and we're gonna do that pink ballerina. This one right here, I love this color so much until the one that has the, the name on it is somewhere in my house, I can't find it, okay? <laughs> I had it on, I wear this with my national suit. So here is pink ballerina, fabulous by itself. You could apply it, but when you mix in with the right um, liner, amazing. Now I'm gonna do Berry Delight. So these are my, in the winter, I was rocking sometimes a lip color this color, and sometimes I would go darker and go super, super, super dark. And you talk about totally a hot look, really great. Sometimes I like a matte look and sometimes I just wanna make it glossy. Um, so these are in the Pearl family. Now, Pearl family, we're going Evening Berry. So Evening Berry here. So here you go is Evening Berry. Now, while I show you that Evening Berry, let me just tell you, we have two limited edition ones that are gonna be around your, thanks for hanging with me for the, for the guests. Um, I'm going to tell you the specials and then I'm going to show you lipstick since I'm over my time. I'm going to tell you the special and then I'll tell you lipsticks. We have two limited edition ones and this is the name of it is somebody tell me lilac. So I'm just showing you the lilac next to this family. So this one is limited edition. A dollar is donated for breast cancer research. And um, I'll show you the other limited edition one, but let me keep going here. Um, and Soft Nude is considered to be in the Pearl family. Now this one, totally nude, barely there. So the nude is gonna depend. Sometimes I want nude nude. Sometimes I want nude with a, with a little hint of pink. Sometimes I like nude with a little bit of, a little bit lighter. And now we're going to do the shimmers. So the shimmers, if in doubt, my very favorite shade that I love to demo on my ivory skin clients, always sell Fancy Nancy. Um, Vicki, what are the top three shades that ivory skin tone, your ivory clients love? And consultants, what are the top three? Do I have any Latina sisters that are watching? What are the top Three. And you know what? If somebody is a makeup wearer, they can wear it all because black women look great in Fancy Nancy too. But Fancy Nancy is, it's just really, really, really good. Okay. Um, and Sheer Illusion. There we go. This is 
clear with a little pop of pearl. Clear with a little pop of pearl. So you put it on sexy. Yep. Mm -hmm. Fancy Nancy. Okay, Vicki totally agreed. And while I have that sheer, let me just show you the other limited edition one is called um, Confident Pink. So I was wearing this one, um, the pink ballerina with my national suit, but I've been wearing, I've been mixing these two, this Confident Pink. I love it. And if you put like a pink on like that and you think it's too bright, then that's where your um, that's where using your um, your liner is going to make a difference. OK, um, beach bronze. This is if there's just one shade you want to show to a bronze skin woman, this is like everybody loves a beach bronze. You can mix it in with everything. It's like a mainstay. I've worn it so much until I almost stopped wearing it because it was my it was my stay forever. And I actually have kind of gone to Copper Aura even more because Copper Aura is beach bronze with a little bit more oof. So it's those are the two side by side. So I'm going to apply. I'm going to um, apply my lips and then I'm going to tell you the specials and then I'm going to show you lipsticks. Now, when I do this, Vicki said sheer illusions for everybody. Fancy Nancy, sheer illusions, unique mauve. Okay, so I'm applying deep nude with mirror. Give me some props for that. I have full lips and full lips are for sale right now. So I am accentuating my full lips. Some days I'll fill it in, but this is pretty deep. So I'm just applying it there. Now I am going to cheat before and I'm gonna apply naturally buff. This is my, I'm not just gonna do the gloss. Cause this is what's gonna make it last all day. Three more minutes, I'll tell you the specials for our guests and then anyone who can still stay. But we've got all kinds of, as soon as I'm done, I'm gonna show you the different lip sticks that would be my favorite ones to put like underneath the glosses. Um, and now I'm going to apply, I don't know, Tawny Nude and maybe Nude Blush. I kind of put that on the outside. One of the benefits of having a big full lip is I got a lot of lip to work on. I have to say, I've never been on YouTube, put my lips all up in the camera, okay? And YouTubers, you still, you can't keep chocolate on your shelf is what Yolanda says. And I just grabbed some nude blush, maybe some sheer illusions. Pop it in the middle. But I'm telling you, clients, you can eat. Uh, when, I mean, don't get me wrong. If I rub like this, it's going to come off. But I'm still going to have a hint of color. It's amazing. The staying power is amazing. Do we have a lip plumper? We do not have a lip um, uh, um product with the claim of plumping your lips. But the lip primer, I would say, and with a liner, if you do want fuller lips, then you can master lining with a nude line outside, a little bit further out. But that bow, accentuating the bow helps, is the sexy part. And if your lips aren't that bow shape, just draw on the bow shape and it's all good. So let me tell you the specials and then I'm going to show you gloss lipsticks because lipsticks are everything. So this is a great special today. Okay. First thing, if anybody actually did 
um, yep, liner helps your, gl your gloss to last too. You can put liner all over the place. So your beauty consultant wants to follow up with you. And one of the things that she's gonna ask you is who do you know who would enjoy being pampered? So this is the beauty of friendship. And for every body that you refer, this is nine referrals. We're gonna give you an opportunity to get some goodies for free. So this could be all glosses. I didn't redo it, but just pretend that this was an opportunity to get all glosses for when you refer Sally and she um, says yes to a Mary Kay uh, lip teeny party or a Fab Five or something like that. Um, so think about who you can refer. Um, to your beauty consultant. Just take that tic-tac-toe, fill in three names, six names, you know, a cross down or a dog on it, fill in the whole board with some sharp women. It'd be really great. And I'm going to give you another opportunity for um, something fun. Post a selfie uh, of you with your favorite lip color, Mary Kay or non-Mary Kay, but I love it if you get some Mary Kay and post a selfie and tag me um, at Katrina Harris Earl. Um, and put hashtag MK lip game. And um, it'll be really fun. And so consultants, you could totally do this at your uh, lip teeny parties and uh, pick out of the hat. And then from the selfies, you can pick a prize, pick one person, ask her to select, pick one person from the hashtag, ask her to pick a number, and then whatever you have behind that prize is there. So let me tell you, today before we do that um glosses our glosses are 16. you're not going to find anybody's glosses that are 16 like okay our glosses are 16. our lipsticks are 18. our liners are 12. the satin lips is 22. the lip primer is 25 and the cost of having a beauty consultant like moi priceless so your beauty consultant is priceless so this is a jam and special today um, buy three, get one half price. Okay. Buy four, get one free. Buy six, get two free. And host a lip teeny party like this with five girlfriends. This is my first time doing it. I went over. I'm going to get this down to where it's 30 minutes. Um, but I added the games and some fun stuff on the end. I hope you enjoyed it. And in the uh, when you actually host one, um, if you do it in Zoom, then of course it's interactive and you can chat or you could do it in a Facebook group and people can just watch like we've been doing today. Um, or even with YouTube where you have it unlisted and it's just a link for you and your friends. And if you do that, you get 50% off. If you decided that you're like, you know what? I love what we did today. I would love to know more about Mary Kay. Well, there's something called the lipstick effect, and it's the theory that when facing an economic crisis, consumers will be more likely to buy less costly, luxurious goods. I'm about to go with my mama to help her buy a new car, but I'm telling you, uh, we waited as long as we could to buy this new car because, you know, in this time of uneasiness, people don't want to buy big ticket items. So instead of buying expensive cars and so forth, people will buy expensive lipstick and ours isn't expensive. The underlying assumption is that consumers will buy luxury goods even when there is a crisis. So this is what I'm telling you why Mary Kay has been booming. Skincare is up, lipstick is up so much. And I want you just to know, check this out. According to figures from the group that tracks retail data in the past four weeks, lipstick sales have jumped over 80% over the same period last year during the pandemic. According to the data, lipstick sales hit $34 million last month. Mass off lipstick on. This could be a great opportunity. I could show a woman how she could sell a lipstick a week and you can invest that bad boy and watch what happens to it in 30 years. Just from selling a few lipsticks, this is an estimate of the global lipstick market, just lipsticks alone, you guys. And we've got so many other products, but $12.5 billion by 2026 was the original. This is what they were thinking pre-pandemic and now it's been increased. Now they're expecting, at first it was 12 billion by 2026, now, because of the power of the lipstick effect, 13.4 billion by 2024. And so you could get a cut of that, a piece of that, and um, that's exciting. So for the guests, if there's any guests that need to drop off, just know if you could just type 
that in the chat um, and your beauty consultant will contact you. But I'm gonna tell you um, about some of our lipsticks and I'm gonna do this really, really um, as quick as I can. We've got a host of colors. One of the things we have, my favorite ones are semi-matte. Let me just say that. But we have our true dimensions. Don't sleep on these. And again, what I mean by that is sometimes we overlook these bad boys, but this is great for summer. They're sheer and we've got so many of them, but I pulled out some of my faves that could also help you. Not everybody wants a nude lip, but these are really super sheer and you can mix them in. So these condition more, they're not matte, but they're not as rich as a lipstick. Sparkling Rose, um, I love this one, is Subtly You. I love it. It's very subtle. You can kind of see. So these are very subtle lips. Um, this one is First Blush. Of course, we have deeper shades. I just pulled out a few of them. Your lookbook, you can download the lookbook on your beauty consultant's website. Um, this one is Natural Beauty, which is probably the one that I wear the most. This is great just for, excellent. You put that on with that um, nude liner, any one of the nude liners, and you're ready to go. And then this one is Chocolate. Don't do, O-N-G, don't do that chocolate and then do this chocolate and then do that, that dark chocolate liner. Don't even try that because I'm just telling you. Okay, I'm not required. I can't, I'm not responsible. You might have some more kids. Okay, so, <laughs> so we've got all kinds of those um, in the line, just to name out some of the other colors of the True Dimensions. That's called True Dimensions. And your beauty consultant can grab you the um, uh, chart that's in the lookbook. But here we go pink blush, all of these colors comes in. There's even a citrus, but these are very sheer. They're not highly pigmented. These are very sheer for the woman who wants sheer, but we've got, you name it, we got it all the way down. So you can see very a la mode, we've got it. Beauty consultants, even if you don't have this, you can take those. It's really a great way to show glosses is using a, you can play around with it with um, uh, a paper plate or a particular um, paper. Some of them, it will really show on there. That's one great way. But another great way is just to play around with them yourself and take pictures over a different time. Okay. And then there is posh pink and apricot um, and an apricot color too. There's two more in there. All right. So let's go to our some more nudes okay probably i'll be done in eight minutes for sure so these are some of the other nudes i have on naturally buff rich truffle is another great that is a, a great nude um this one is sunset peach they, these are, some of these are semi-matte and some of them are semi-shine and you could tell the one when they go on. So again, what do I like doing with these? I like using them as a base because you add a couple glosses as a base and it's gonna change up your lipstick. Bashful You is a little bit lighter when I want it to go lighter than the Naturally Buff. And you could tell I'm really into the nude look. Naturally buff, I showed you that. That's the one I'm wearing. So, so look how light that looks on me. Like that would not necessarily be the color I would jump at um, if I didn't understand color and what it does. But when you put it on and you blend it in with the whole thing and then rosewood, all of these. So, okay, be honest. How many of you, even if I wasn't in Mary Kay, I'm not a crazy makeup person. Like I don't have to wear makeup every day. I'm okay going out with no makeup, but I could have 50 lipsticks, even if I wasn't American, <laughs> okay? Because lipstick is personality. 
All right, if you've been wearing the same one for a long time, um, oh yeah, Yolanda, I want you to do a uh, confident pink and then let me know how that works. All right, I've got one more series. I'm gonna show you some of the rich ones and then we will be done. And of course, it's the last one I grabbed. Okay, so here we go. Um, spiced ginger. This is, has a little bit of spice to it. Brown with a little hint of spice. Scarlet red, OMG. So this is red, but it's a, this is, it's not a, a fire engine red. It's a deeper red, amazing. Now you take that, and you you could just go to town on which way you're going. You could put the iconic red on there. You could put the berry delight on there. You could mix it in with pink, or you could mix it in with berry. Like you literally can make your own lip color. Okay. Um, I showed you the rosewood, red smolder. So baby, we got plenty of red. So this is an orange or red. So this is red smolder. You see the two different reds. Red. The great thing about Mary Kay, everything being 100%, you see that's a warm red and a cool red. You don't just need one red. There's a neutral red, and I'll show you that, but we got a warm red and a cool red. Don't sleep on Mary Kay, but we got it all. Apple, berry, a lot of makeup artists that just, they have no idea. So apple berry is pink, pink, pink. That's hot, okay? That's hot. I love a bubblegum pink, the color of my background. Midnight red. Okay, can you tell I like this one? This is a demo. This one is another red. So you can see that one is a brick red, a rust red. And that looks good on a lot of people. Getting down to it, but we got a lot of colors. This is also another popular one. Crushed berry. So this is in the berry family. Berry. There we go. So you take that and you mix that in with evening berry gloss. And now you got a color that's gonna last. You could wear it matte or you could do the gloss and don't add the liner to it, right? Do add the liner to it. Okay, if you know me, you know I love me some poppy please because we ain't done nothing in the orange family, but orange, I like it orange, orange pop it orange, like orange crush orange, okay? I hope every single guest has had a great time and I hope that you have filled up your, if you have not filled up your tic-tac-toe with just things that you're interested in, I don't know what's wrong with you, okay? I'm <laughs> just saying, every woman needs color. Add some color to your life. Don't just do one or two lipsticks. Now, you might not be able to get all of them now, although maybe that 50% offer, it's only $30 to become a beauty consultant and you can have all you want for 50%. This is powerful pink. Now, I'm gonna tell you a true story and then I'm gonna be done. I think I have eight more colors to show. My grandmother, God rest her soul, my um, on my father's side, paternal grandmother, um, step grandmother, I should say, but grandmother in love, mauve moment. See how pigmented these are? It's like, are you kidding me? All right. Um, always apricot. I'm going higher. Always apricot. So you could take that and mix that in with unique mauve, mix that in with fancy Nancy. It's going to look beautiful. And you're going to have two different colors. If I put the fancy Nancy on there, I'm going to have one color. And if I put the unique mauve on there, I'm going to have another color. And so you just go from day to evening. Seriously, you want your husband, your man to look and go, ooh, just change your lipstick up. It'd be like, well, what are you doing? Sometimes I go, oh, I don't like that. You're like, I'm trying, I'm practicing. So I left church one Sunday 
And I took my grandmother out to breakfast, brunch in Alameda. This is apple berry. We went out to brunch in Alameda. We wanted waffles. So we it was one of these places so popular, people line up. I had to line up, keep her in the car and bring her inside. Some kind of way, almost done y'all. Barry Couture. I'm running out of arm, okay? Some kind of way we got on lipsticks. The ladies got on lipsticks. Okay, this is another one of my favorites, hot pink. If I want to work with what I've got in the background here, this is the hot pink. And I went, I had my lipsticks in a tray similar to this, all kinds, I had it in a caddy and I had it in my car. Pink Cadillac, will travel, had it in my car. During lunch, this is another one, love me pink. This is, this matches the background, okay? And I will take that and throw that on with confident pink. I set those lip glosses down on the table. Look at this, hot pink with confident pink. Okay, I need everybody to try that. I promise you, it's pretty. And if it's too bright for you, then you can mix it in and go darker, like with the with one of the fuchsia ones. I set the lipsticks down. I sold three hundred dollars to the waitresses sitting right there, and people say they do not have time to do Mary Kay. I'm like, do you have time to eat? Women love lip gloss. You could sell three hundred dollars worth of lip gloss, make one hundred fifty bucks in 30 minutes, because I think I just sold $300 with lip gloss at least. Okay, and the last one is lilac. This is a different one, what's it called? Luminous lilac something. I know I'm jacking it up and saying it wrong. Uh, luminous lilac, no I'm not. So there we go, we got color. So if nothing else, I hope you've realized that we have color for you. I hope that you have realized that oil free eye makeup remover is a must because this will get everything off. Um, we have a bundle that's taking place right now with our oil free eye makeup remover, which is a must for removing eyes and lips, and our um, micellar water, which you use to pre wash your face every place, not your eyes. And those two are amazing. And this water by itself will not get your skin nearly as clean as this micellar water. It doesn't replace our skincare system, but it does um, do the job to wash during the day or before. So I will start off when it's time to take this off with removing my lashes, then taking my eye makeup remover, getting rid of my brows, flipping over the eye. I make remove or remove my lipstick, micellar water all over, and then go to town with my cleansing system. I would love for you to um, answer the phone when your beauty consultant reaches out to you so that you can uh, decide what you want to get. Again, the specials, I'm gonna share it. The specials today are, um, the specials today are, Buy three, get one half price. Buy four, get one free. Buy six, get two free. And host a lip teeny party and get 50% off or decide to become a beauty consultant and it's $30 holla. You could become a beauty consultant and get everything that you want for free. Lipstick and a great pair of shades is all any woman needs. So thanks for joining. Yay, yay, yay. <laughs> all right, appreciate you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, National. Awesome. I appreciate y'all. Thank you. Okay. And I'm hanging out it just in case any guest really has uh, questions at all. Thank I'm you, Katrina. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Miss Shirley. I think that was you. Thank you. Yes. Have a good one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you thank for you. Mississippi. Bye bye, y'all. Have a great day. Thank you. Appreciate Thank everything. You. Thank you. Thank I appreciate you. All. Thank you. Yeah. Bye bye. Awesome.